In this video, we will go through the computation questions from one CXC CSEC paper to examination. To get the most out of this video, pause it here and attempt each part. If you are stuck on any, check the description below for the link to the video that covered that topic. Post a comment. Let me know how you are managing. Last chance to pause the video. Okay, let's go. 1A part 1. 2 subtract 1 is equal to 1. 1 plus 3 is equal to 4. The LCM of 5, 3 and 2 is equal to 30. 2 fifths as a fraction over 30. The denominator 5 is multiplied by 6 to get 30. So you multiply the numerator by 6 as well. 2 multiplied by 6 is equal to 12. Subtract 1 third as a fraction over 30. 3 is multiplied by 10 to get 30. So you multiply 1 by 10 to get 10. We add it to a half as a fraction over 30. 2 is multiplied by 15 to get 30. So you multiply 1 by 15. It's equal to 12 subtract 10 is equal to 2. 2 plus 15 is equal to 17. It's equal to 4 and 17 over 30. Part 2. But math says we will call the brackets first, then the powers, and later on we do the addition. This is equal to 4.14 divided by 5.75 is equal to 0 0.72. 0 0.72. And we add that to 1.62 squared. 1.62. 6.2 squared 2.6244 So now we add 0 0.72 to 2.6244 2.6244 added to 0 0.72 is equal to 3.3444 is equal to 3. 3, 4, 4, 4. Part 3. 2 multiplied by 3.142 multiplied by 1.25 is equal to 7.855. Part 4. The square root of 2.89 multiplied by tan 45 degrees. The square root of 2.89 is equal to one point seven. Tan of forty five degrees is equal to one. And we have 1.7 multiplied by 1 is equal to 1.7 because we know that any number multiplied by 1 is itself. I am Mr. Dubé. Remember, to get the most out of my channel, please view the videos in order using the playlist. If you found this video useful, please like this video. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe. Join me in the next video.